Hi, and welcome to another video on how to palm read. So today we'll be talking about the fate line. The fate line shows your direction in life. It's a line that's strongly associated with your career and your path. So it starts down here at the bottom, so that's when you were born, and it reaches the headline here, and that's about roughly 35 years old-ish. And if it reaches the heart line here, it's about 55 to 60 years old. So kind of around a little bit before retirement age. Some people say it is retirement age at that time. Um, so just like our previous video, I'm just gonna repeat and say the certain markings on the lines can show periods of challenges or difficulties. So when you see them here, such as let's say some islands or bars, it just shows periods of unemployment or confusion or career setbacks during that time at that age. So let's start off talking about the quality of the fate line. So when it's a bold, clear line, again, clear lines are always awesome. Uh, this person, it shows they have goals and values of their own. So it kind of like they have a settled direction in their life, a strong will. So the stronger the line, the stronger the person's sense of purpose and direction that they have for themselves. It doesn't necessarily mean that they are in their dream career or um, uh, if that makes sense. So if it's weak, the line is weak, it's faint, kind of patchy. Uh, this person is, it just shows that this person's unsure of their direction in life or they, they're just unsure of their life purpose. And if the line is broken, it shows a career change or any other major life change. So it could be moving, a relationship change, um, happening at that time frame whenever you find the break. And if you have a line that appears and then there's like, it stops and then it starts again, you know, um, you it just shows that you have quite a few changes in career or employers or companies just because you might be bored or frustrated or you feel like there's a lack of challenges. And if the line starts later in the life here, it can mean that the person might be, um, it can mean a couple things. So the person might be dependent on other people throughout life based on their environment. So let's say it's someone that marries early and they be, just decide to become um, a stay at home mom and the husband provides financially. Or the person is still figuring out, just think about like a teenager that's just still figuring out who they are and what they want to do in their life as their life purpose. So this person might feel lost during quite the beginning years of their life and um, just who they are as a person. And so you might see the, the line just not even appear at all until much later in life. So um, the fate line is probably the major line out of the four major lines. It's the one that can be missing. And it just shows like a person that never knows what they want to do, want to be. And um, again, just remember from video number one that lines can change. So I'd advise this person to just get to know themselves better so they can start to move towards what, you know, they really want to get out of life. And after that, you can see the lines changing once they get a sense of direction. Okay, so let's talk about where the fate line starts. So if it's joined, tucked in here, like if it's joined here from the lifeline or really close to the lifeline, or it's tucked behind here like this, that means the person is strongly influenced by the family. So they're probably maybe likely to follow the family business or their parents told them to choose a certain major or career or to like, you know, um, I don't know, I would say be a doctor because the family wants them to fall into it, you know, and there's a lot of pressure there. Um, if the line starts more down here on the Luna Mount, the person, is, it's opposite actually. They usually make deci decisions based on what they want to do out of their life, you know, determined to do their own thing. They're a bit more independent. They'd rather do their own thing instead of be influenced by others or the family. And because it comes from the Luna Mount, so if you remember from our previous video, um, the Luna Mount is about imagination, creativity, intuition. So the path that this person goes on can be quite particular and imaginative and creative. If the line starts down the middle of the palm like this one right here, it just shows a well-balanced person who's developed an early sense of maturity. So they found a balance between being, you know, strongly influenced by family versus being determined to do their own thing. So it's kind of like in between. 
And finally, let's talk about where the fate line ends. So if it ends here at the headline, that is considered a short fate line. So uh, what this means or what it could mean is that this person might have lost direction and purpose in life um, at this time. So uh, this is about the mid thirties roughly. So, or they might feel that they've fulfilled their sense of career and they're just surrendered to someone else's will. Or maybe like, let's say they got married and they're like, you know what, I'm gonna, I don't feel like, I feel like my, I'm good with my career. I, I'm not, I wouldn't say retired, but they're fine. Um, just not going as gung ho in their career. And this is going to happen somewhere, um, again, roughly in, let's say like mid thirties ish. And if the line ends at the heart line, that's usually the average, um, length of the fate line. And it just shows a person, this is where they usually end their job and they retire here. So, um, if they do anything after retirement, it could be just easy recreational hobbies that they want to do, such as gardening. And now if it is a long line that ends way past the heart line, this person is probably just keep working. They're going to work past retirement age or they're going to get so involved in some occupation, you know, you know, those people that after retirement, you're like, Jesus, you're still working. It's like that, keeping themselves busy. So, um, like super busy. And if there are multiple fate lines that you might see, um, on, quite a few people's palms and it shows during different parts of their life so there might be some here or like here so it just shows like several different careers or jobs or even side hustles going on at the same time so sometimes you might see this with people that are trying to do like full-time job and like a passion side hustle at the same time so uh, that's that and there you have it for the fate line so check your fate line and what are you able to see? Let us know in the comments below. And again, thank you for watching and don't forget to click on the subscribe button and make sure to check us out at our website at thehappyhealingshop.com for personalized palm, tarot, psychic, or astrology readings. We also have a blog there with lots of free good info if you're looking into learning more. And finally, don't forget to check out our community events we hold by following us on Facebook and Instagram at The Happy Healing Shop.